Now I got this off of eBay. The shipping on this was $46.05. I paid $43 shipping. He quoted $43 shipping, and this came from Michigan, so it was it was 17 pounds. 17.152 pounds. 17 pound 15.2 ounces. Supposed to be two days. This took four days to get here. So I guess their priority wasn't working. Uh, in the comments he did um, say he sent something else similar and that was the weight of it, what the price was. But still it went up $3 that he that uh, he had to pay. I'll show you what I got. This was a great deal on here. You get it open. I did uh, message the, the person after I bought it um, for good packing and uh, he said don't worry about it I'll take care of it and this is packed pretty good here because you know they throw stuff away so this came from the post office when a guy delivered it knocked on the door and I looked at it it was in good shape um, I'll show you what we got here get it out oh. nice shape now this is the Lino New York Central J1E Hudson 763 this is the same locomotive that I have on my train set I bought mine in 1998. I had to order it because they didn't have any there. They, yeah, and I picked it up two weeks later. When I ordered it, I put $200 deposit down. The locomotive was $1,099. When I went to pick it up two weeks later, it was $1,299. But he gave it to me for the $1,099 that we quoted it at. Uh, he, I guess he didn't make no money on it. This locomotive is brand new in a box. The bid was $356 or best offer. I offered $300. So the guy accepted my offer for $300 and I got uh, this locomotive. And a $43 shipping. So $3 and 40, uh, $345. That's a third of what I paid for mine. That's why I bought it. All the paperwork was included. That's the original book. The same book that I got. The warranty card. Now he did uh, say he displayed this engine. But he never ran it on the track because he didn't have a layout. So that's why he was selling all his trains. So even that price of getting a locomotive, even if it was used and it needed a part, I got a train place where I bought mine, they repaired the trains, but for $345 I got this, uh, this train. Now if I'm going to set up another layout, I got another train. But it was too good to pass up on a deal, so I um, I got it. Let me try to get it out if I can. It's original box. The box is a little ripped here in the corner, but no big deal on it. Let me get it out here. Original box. There's the locomotive, same as I have, 763. Okay, it's a uh, no wheel marks on here and that's what I got another locomotive on this 
Now I'm going to run it. I'm going to grease it just like mine. I'm going to take the, the three screws out of this and I'm going to run it. But uh, that's what we picked up. That's the locomotive. And the tender. Get the tender. There's your tender. It's got extra part, extra caster wheels. I gotta look at my box. I don't I think I got an extra caster wheels. I never put on my train. And here's the tender for it. This is uh command equipped. It's got rail sounds, it's got smoke, same as I got. That's why I jumped on it. So three hundred dollars, you ain't gonna beat that. Okay. Great shape on this. Let me see if I get the battery out of here, if there's a battery in this. Hold on, beware, bear with me. Okay, there's no battery in this. So we're gonna make sure there's no battery in here, it ain't, ain't gonna get corroded. We put a 9 volt battery in this, and then you got the rail sounds. This was a great deal on this. $300, you couldn't pass up. That's why I bought it. There's a couple more that are selling for $579. $1,729. And somebody's got one for $428, but his looks used on the bottom. So that's what we got. We got another uh, Lino. But I couldn't pass it up. I paid $1,099 for my train. Here I got this for 300 bucks. So that's what I got from eBay. Another Lionel 763 Hudson.